sort of penetration. Nice ball forward there to Obafemi. The layoff though falls to a white shirt. And Balderson out to Thorsteinson. Good run off the ball there from Good Johnson, and he's found the net. Ison opened the scoring in the 25th minute. We'd hardly seen him in this game. So brilliant ball in behind. He's out round the three defenders. He could have stayed a bit taller, maybe, but he's got in behind us. He has a little look, and he knew exactly what he was doing. He, he, he got big, big indoor arenas and record and stuff. So a lot of stuff can be done indoors for him. Here we go. Or Steinson has done well to drift past. Uh, it was Eddie. Over Femi with the header. And that shot has dragged Buddy back behind the ball, making life difficult for Ireland. It's pretty congested in that Iceland half. Just a problem. And of course, a chance of a break. Good Jonsson feeding the ball wide. Thorsteinson driving towards the Irish area. And the substitute on the flag stayed down. Good save by McGinty. Still alive. Finson. He's a confident player. Like yeah. Plays with confidence. Hasn't seen too much game time for Bohemians this season, actually, Manzrou. I think he only started five games for Bowes this campaign. The ball play for him again. And Troy Parrott as well, so we've got people on board that can, on the pitch that can get us goals. Yeah. Manzrou. Again, Iceland with ten men back behind the ball. Leo Connor across into the area. Cold. He gets a touch. Oh, it's in. Yes. It's a... Chance here for Iceland to strike. Oh, that's a good save. Johansson, Coyote with a firm challenge. Oh, oh yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's nope, naive, nope. isn't it? Absolutely. Quickly, he's managed to keep it in play. Did well there, Troy Parrott. The uh, pass to him didn't really favour him. And Tordarsson driving towards the Irish goal. Samstead is there, dangerous cross, and that's 2-1 to Iceland, and that's it. The winner in stoppage time, you have to feel for Iceland. Samstead did very well, the record caps holder. That's a great little overlap, William. Ireland down to 10 men, stretched the full-time whistle, and what a famous victory this is for Iceland, the celebrations.